happy Monday. Um, I've been up for a while, but it's about 6 a.m. I'm actually doing this homework that I was supposed to have done by today, but today is my class. I have a class today. I have an insulin administration class, so I'm going to be learning how to administer insulin and get certified on that. And I also have another test today, so I'll go to school in a couple hours. My class don't start till 9 today, so... Got a little time this morning to just chill, kick back, spend some time. I have like a slow morning. So I like that. But I am up early. This is my homework. Um, it says, please read the entire book and answer all lesson evaluation questions before the first day of class. So this is the book. Um, uh, one of my friends in my class, his name is Mark. If you watch my weekly vlog, you see what I'm talking about. Um, he had did his little questions during class the other day, and it didn't take him very long. So this shouldn't take me very long. But yeah, after I get up and stuff, I'm gonna get dressed, put my scrubs on and stuff like that, and hit the class. But yeah, I just woke up. Um, I just actually got off the trap. You know, you feel me? I did me a little point five. <laughs> so yeah, I'm about to do this work catch back up with y'all in a second hey you guys what's up hello <laughs> so i just got out of class and when i get home i'm gonna talk to y'all about what i learned because it's so hot right now and i just hit y'all up when i get home but i did go to class today for that class <sighs> yeah i'll talk to y'all when i get to the crib grand rising i just woke up kind of up a little bit late because last night i worked out so <laughs> i woke up later than normal i usually wake up pretty 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 early but i didn't today i have to go to school today and i have a test today um i need to go grab my backpack okay <laughs> so today we are gonna have a test on how to administer insulin so i have a needle that i had from class right here a syringe it actually says insulin syringe so you don't think i do drugs and so yeah, during our class today, we are going to be learning how to to do the injection. We all took each other's blood sugar and stuff using the thing. I'm not I don't have diabetes. I don't I don't know a diabetic. So I've never did that before. So if you can see that she basically was like you the way you take the insulin is you draw up the air first. And then it'll be a little bottle of insulin and then you put it in there push the air back in then you draw it you turn it upside down and then you turn it back over you pop it off or no you pop it off while it's at the top then you get the thing you pinch it we had some little things that we were practicing on i'm pretty sure if i had like a piece of fruit or something i could practice on that um and then you hold it like a dart, like, like this. And then you do it quick, pop. And then if it's a lot, you go slow. But if it's not a lot, you just shoot it in there. Say if it's like five units of insulin, you just pop it in there and then choop, and then pull it out. So that's what we was working on yesterday. Um... And we was working on how to like handle the needles and stuff without sticking yourself. Of course, you always wear your gloves. And you don't want to stick yourself because some people, they have HIV, they have AIDS. You don't know what people have. So you have to be really careful when you're handling needles. So this girl in class, she actually stuck her finger after she took the girl's blood pressure. But luckily, the girl was her sister, like her blood sister. So she was like, it's okay. But the teacher was like, no, it's not okay. You want to make sure that you never try to not stick yourself it's she said that the highest population with hiv is the older generation because they have 
got in treatment for it and they live longer so they do have hiv sometimes um but yeah we learned about hyper and hyperglycemia basically one of them is when your blood sugar is too low then one of them is when your blood sugar is too high um when i got home last night i had cooked i made some spaghetti i was supposed to cook taco salad but i didn't have everything i needed like i forgot to get the taco seasoning at the store and all of that so yeah this i was supposed to study a little bit last night but i was tired and i had worked out last night um so <laughs> yeah i'm trying to catch up this morning before i go to class luckily my class don't start till nine so <sighs> i have a little bit of time um i'm gonna do it i'm gonna study i just wanted to show you guys that i'm studying right now um but yeah i need to i might go to the mall after i leave class today today should be my last day of class if i pass all my tests which i should yesterday i passed my test i got another certificate let me show y'all i just remembered Wait, okay and i need to go to the dmv again i have to go to the dmv and i need to go grab me like three memory cards because i'm so tired of deleting stuff because i'll be running through memory cards for my cameras and yeah so that's what my day is gonna look like i'm about to finish studying i'm gonna get ready for school and i will catch you guys at school and if i go to those places after school i will let you know so see you then okay y'all what's up i am i'm at school now it is about 8 30 like i told y'all my class is for tonight all of my little classmates are here you feel me there's a couple of them back there but yeah today i have a test um this will be my final day <laughs> thank you jesus like i was telling y'all before after this i'm gonna start working um so i can't wait for that that's exciting and yeah i'm about to go into school in a minute um i'm about to look at over somewhere my paperwork so i can make sure i pass this test okay i want to go to the mall because i had got this um bubble bath the other day and it was like four dollars because it was on sale and i love it it's called oatmeal something and i want to get another one for my mama because i know it'll be good for her because oatmeal like calms her skin so i'm gonna go get her one if they have it i hope they do because i just got it a couple weeks ago they should still have it i don't know but i hope so so i'll go to the mall after i leave here so i'll see y'all at the mall okay i am at the mall as you can see like i told y'all before yeah, like I told you before, I'm here to get that body wash. Oh, look at the puppies. Okay, I am leaving the mall now. Leaving the 
them all. Got the soap that I wanted, praise God. She only had four left, so I got two. Because I told y'all that um, I was getting one for my mama. Because my mama loves like oatmeal soaps and stuff for her skin. And then I just got an extra one just in case like I use all mine or if my sister wanted, I don't know. But let me show y'all what I got. We're trying to beat the heat, baby. But look, this is what I got. I got these two soaps. It is the oatmeal collado or whatever. And then I just got two hand sanitizers. I'm gonna get my sister one. One of them is like wild berry and one of them is apple picking. But yeah, I'm about to go take my sister. She is in the process of painting a mural right now. So I'm gonna take her to her mural. And then I'm gonna just go home and chill and work on some stuff I need to work on. I'll catch y'all when I get home. Hey, my big daddy chauffeur be whipping it. Yeah. Yeah, don't hit that car big me stove, but, but you can whip it. Yeah. Somebody say, look, listen, look, look at this comment. Okay, say. Okay. Like it. Look stuff in there. He did it for the leaves. That's a flower. Motherfucker. It's cabbage. This is cauliflower. Look like greens. Yeah, you probably can't eat the leaves. Corn beef. Corn beef and hash. There's a mint. <laughs> Corn beef and hash. You know that was still growing back in the greenhouse? The tomato plant? The mint down there. Oh, no, I didn't. Don't get in there, Big Josh. Big Josh is hot in there. Don't get in there. Be quiet. I'm trying to record for the vlog next week. So this week was an interesting week. Um, I was more busy than focused on actually recording the vlog. So I don't even know what I have. Hopefully I have enough for the weekly vlog. But I didn't do too much. I finished up my classes for my, um, my uh, medical aid certification. And then I had an insulin administration class. I learned how to give insulin. We learned how to take um, blood sugar. I never did that before. So like we had to stick each other's fingers and get the blood and take the the blood glucose level. That was interesting. Um, I feel for diabetics because they got to do that every day. Multiple times a day. You got to stick your fingers up. And I just feel for them. Um, but yeah, this week, like I said, it was downtime. This week coming up is the week of 4th of July. And so hopefully like my family barbecue or something, the kids pop some fireworks. Um, I don't know, hopefully they do something fun. So I'll make sure I record that. And also this week I'm gonna have a lot of videos, different types of videos. I'm gonna have another reset video. I'm gonna have a, um, some encouraging videos. I'm gonna have some silent vlogs, the chats with Derry Hill. 
Um, I recently took down my knowledge braids, as you can see. Yesterday I did a um, I washed my hair and I deep conditioned it. So my scalp is feeling amazing. Oh my gosh. I'm going to be wearing my real hair out and letting it breathe a little bit. Right now, I'm doing my laundry at the laundromat. Um, I meant to actually record that, but like I said, I've been more busy than focused on recording. So, yeah, this is going to be the end of the weekly vlog. Like I said, I pray that I got enough for this video. I don't know, but I'll see you guys next week on Monday because that's when I upload my weekly vlogs is on Monday. So make sure you tap in every Monday. And make sure y'all share these videos like on y'all social medias because I don't got social media. This all I got is YouTube. So put it on your Facebook. Put it on your Twitter. Put it on your Instagram. Put it on your TikTok. Put it wherever you want. And share the links to my videos on y'all social media. So yeah, I pray that this video blessed you. I love y'all. God bless y'all. And I'll see y'all next time. So I got $17, okay? That's what we got. I'm about to go into Whole Foods and I'm about to go into Whole Foods and see what we can get for $17. I just need some fruit for the week. So we about to see what we can do. Okay, let's go.